Chinese is such a fun and fast divertissement in Nutcracker, and being that it is Chinese, I really wanted to use the colors of the Chinese flag. However, red is very, very tricky to use on the eyes, so I used orange instead and saved the red for the lips. Because most costumes of the Chinese divertissement tend to fall under the bright China colors, this makeup should really, really work for any company's production. Now here is how this makeup is going to look under the lights of Act 2. As you can see, not a lot changes, the colors just deepen. This look is actually quite simple, so I'm going to show you how I do it. After applying a basic foundation and contour, I'm going to start with a bright gold shadow and apply it all the way from the lid up to the brow bone. I'm going to contour my eye with a warm bronze shadow, just applying it into the crease and blending. I'm going to line my top lash line with a liquid black liner, starting in the middle and working towards the inner corner and then winging out towards the outside. Now I'm going to take a forest green shadow and apply this directly over the black line I just created. This is a really good way to color your eyeliner and still keep it dark so you don't have to buy a million colored eyeliners. Now I'm going to take a brown pencil and just line my crease, just one solid line from the inner corner connecting to the green line. Now I'm going to blend this out with the same bronze shadow I used to contour my eye. Just keeps it simple. Please ignore that little black line on my right eye. That's a mistake and should not be there. For this next step, I'm going to take an orange eyeshadow or orange lip gloss if you have one, doesn't matter, and just line about halfway under the brown line. You don't want to go all the way, just about half. This just gives you a nice pop of color. Taking the same brown eyeliner I used in my crease, I'm going to line my lower lash line from the inner corner all the way out, right up under the green. Using the same bronze shadow I used above the eye, now I'm going to blend this line out below the eye. Taking the orange shadow or lip gloss, I'm going to apply this just on the inner corner of my eye. You don't want too much orange, just a bit. Now I'm going to curl my lashes, as always, apply my favorite mascara, you can use anything, and yes, of course, apply the false lashes. A false lash tutorial is coming, I promise. For my cheeks, I'm just going to use a sheer peach blush, nothing too drastic. For the liner, I'm going to use a really pure red. Now, if you're more blue skin toned, as we talked about in the skin tone video, use a more blue based, and if you're warmer skin tone, use a warmer based red. Now I'm going to also apply a red lip gloss to fill this in, and you might need to go back over it with the liner just to give a nice even line. So that is my Nutcracker Chinese makeup. Now obviously, if you are required to do a full Chinese look, such as the black wig and the really um, Asian-inspired eyes, this obviously wouldn't work for you, but this is just my take on it to still keep it classical for the stage. I hope you all love this look. Thank you so much for watching, and here's some more videos you might enjoy. Also, please feel free to subscribe here. I'd love to have you.